Hey guys, it's Freddy Tech back with another video from CFL Tech. We have another media news story from StreamingBetter.com and it will be linked down below if you want to check it out. Now this is not good news if you are a Hulu Live TV subscriber. Here we go again. The annual price increase is back. Now we were hoping to get through 2024 with minimal price increases, especially for the live TV uh, services. Unfortunately, we have another one here for Hulu Live TV. The last one was August of 2023, so a year ago at the time of this recording. So with this increase, you're looking at $6 more per month. It's a very similar increase to last year's. Now, when you come to October 17th, when this happens, you'll be paying $13 more per month from July of 2023. So that's a fairly sizable increase in that time frame in 14 months and there's no end in sight these companies are continuing to do this especially the big guys you wonder how much really can they absorb do they really need to pass this on to consumers or is it just total corporate greed we know corporate greed does occur that's without a doubt but this is really becoming something else it's really tough for a lot of families to afford entertainment just want to have a little bit of fun, a little bit of family time, watch some shows together, watch some Disney content. And here you go again with another price increase. So get ready, folks. It's coming again. We haven't seen too many live TV streaming services you know, with price increases in 2024. I would not be surprised if we don't get through the rest of the year from DirecTV Stream without a price increase. Maybe we'll see one with YouTube TV. They're really holding down a bit i think they know they caught a lot of heat especially youtube tv when they had their price increase last time they had already lost some channels as well so it was just a bad look so they've been holding off for a while so i would not be surprised though if we do see one coming before the end of the year if not definitely by the first quarter of 2025 so we'll see what happens with those services but right now we're talking about hulu and this will be occurring here on October 17th, so get prepared for your budget on that. If you keep the service, that is, maybe you're going to drop them after this and you had enough. Put your comments down below on what, what your thoughts are on this. Are you done with these services? Go with just free ad-supported services. Now, the with ads and without ads are both seeing the price increase. So if you have the without ads with you know Hulu, uh, no ads, Disney Plus, no ads, and ESPN Plus with no ads, the price will increase to $95.99 a month on the same day. So get ready for that. So you can't escape the price increase with you know either way. So in other words, regardless of whether you sign up for the with ads or no ads plan, all Hulu Live subscribers can expect to pay an additional $6 each month beginning October 17th, 2024. So get ready. So we see these increases, they continue to happen. How do you have you had enough? Are you leaving this service? What will you do? Put your comments down below. It is really getting to a point you really have to wonder how much more are they incurring? Yes, they have price increases. Yes, they have carriage disputes, carriage agreements that the content goes up, but we don't see the balance sheet. We don't know how much they can absorb. Disney has so many entities. They make tons and tons of money and they continue to increase prices at their theme parks and also on the streaming entertainment. So put your comments down below. Are you leaving Hulu Live? Or were you thinking of going to Hulu Plus Live TV and now not going to them? Because you see this price increase coming here real soon. So get ready, price hike on the way, never ending. So put your thoughts down below. Freddie Tech will be checking out of this one. Soon to be back with another. Take care.